And, uh, checking your check engine light codes on a 4th gen Maxima. Um, again, let's go down to the ECU. Normally, it's going to be right there next to the gas pedal. You're going to pull off the cover. You're going to see the front of the ECU, a little screw. Use that, of course. Mine is no longer down there. You get bored one day and extended the harness to make it easier. So now my ECU sits all the way out here. It's intended to go in the glove box, but I just never got around to putting it in. So, obviously first you're going to pop your key in, turn the ignition on, turn the windshield wipers off, and there you've got that pesky little check engine light. It's all dirty. And check engine light. So, you have your ECU here, and you can see the diagnostic screw. And there's instructions next to it, but whatever. So, what you're going to do... Stick your screwdriver in that little screw right there, turn to the right, hold it for two seconds, then you turn it back. You look up here, check engine light starts blinking. That was three, two, three, four, five. Oh, three, oh, five. That's EGR, I believe. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, one, two, three, ten out of three. That's EGR as well. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five. Actually, ten out of five might be EGR, but all right. You just can't basically count the. Uh, the slow flashes is your first digit, anywhere from uh, 0, 1 to, I believe it goes up to 10, uh, it might be, no, 12 if you're an automatic. Then the, uh, the fast flashes, and here's the slow, it's the first digit. The quick flashes are the uh, second digit, or set of digits. Um, for example, if you've got, you got three slow flashes, then four quick ones, 0304 is your knock sensor, which... It won't light up the check engine light, but most people have that code anyway. And, uh, yeah. So then if you want to clear the codes, come back down to your ECU. Or, for y'all, it'll be down there. Down to your ECU. Turn the screw to the right. Leave it for two seconds. Turn it back to the left. Didn't do it all the way. Be very, very gentle. Like, you don't want to break this. <laughs> That's, you know, just use two fingers. And you'll feel when it stops. It just stops. Don't force it, because you will. Be pissed off at yourself when you start the car. Uh oh, if the car starts. And then your check engine light is now off. The uh, codes are cleared. Emissions readiness monitors monitors are also cleared, so you'll have to drive around uh, if you need to go through emissions. Just like pulling the battery. Uh, yeah, that's how you check check engine light codes on fourth gen Maxima. Also note the uh, 99s, among other changes say the least. Uh, their little screw down there on the ECU is going to be a tiny uh, Phillips head, just like this. And it's going to be a little further back, so I've heard.